Hello, my name is Joanne Ahern from the Neil Squire Society, and this presentation is on Assertive versus Aggressive Approach. This presentation will advance by itself. All you need to do is observe and listen. I will read and explain all information as we go along. Introduction This presentation will demonstrate the importance of being assertive in a job search and provide you with some techniques on how to be assertive versus aggressive. What is the difference? Assertive. It means to declare, give your opinion, or insist in a decided positive way. Aggressive. It means to declare your position by attacking, using strong, inappropriate tone of voice in a negative way. When should you be assertive? Making a follow-up phone call to a potential employer. Being an advocate for yourself and protecting your rights. Assertive versus aggressive. Number one, my first example demonstrates how someone uses an aggressive approach to making a difficult phone call. And number two, my second example will demonstrate the same phone call using an assertive approach. Listen to the difference in my tone of voice. Hi, I'm calling to inquire about the customer service job. I was wondering when you will be making a decision about hiring. Thank you. And now, an assertive approach. Hi, I'm calling to inquire about the customer service job. I was wondering when you will be making a decision about hiring. Thank you. Speaking to an employer or person. Here is an example of someone using an aggressive approach. This image describes a lady pointing her finger, looking angry, and most likely raising her voice. Speaking to an employer or person. Here is an example of someone using an assertive approach. This image describes three people sitting around a table. One gentleman is holding a paper and explaining the points from it and the other people are engaged in positive conversation. This is an assertive approach. The assertive approach wins. The aggressive approach does not help you. The assertive approach shows the person or employer that you can stand up for yourself in a positive way. It engages the person for an open discussion. And it provides you with empowerment where you can state your rights. End of presentation. This concludes our presentation on assertive versus aggressive approach. If you have any questions on this presentation, please do not hesitate to contact your assigned facilitator.